Talo for family, some friends, and welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I will be making a lamb suvalaki flavor butterboard. And probably a couple of months ago um, on TikTok, butterboard became a popular trend. So I am making one of those tonight, but uh, in the form of lamb suvalaki style. Let's start cooking. Here's the ingredients. Lamb pieces, garlic, Italian spices, cumin powder, black pepper, oil, lemon juice, lettuce, tomatoes, chopped parsley, homemade garlic sauce, peach root flavour hummus and homemade mini suvalaki wraps. We will go ahead and marinate our lamb meat. I'm going to add our garlic, cumin powder, Italian spices, black pepper, Give it a stir for now. Let's add lemon juice and oil. Let's mix this well. We will marinate this in the fridge for about a couple of hours, two to four hours. If you can do it overnight, it's even better. But uh, two to four hours is um, all you need for now. So, or if you're in a hurry, just do it for an hour and then we'll come back in and cook our meat. In the meantime, I'm going to transfer my garlic sauce into an icing bag and then I'll put it back in the fridge as well. Because I'm doing, I'm serving the lamb suvalaki in a butterboard style, I don't need to insert them in skewers. So I am just going to cook them as is. So I've prepared my pan and the meat will go in the oven. Now, if uh, you can cook it on the grill, uh, charcoal grill, it will be really, really nice, give extra taste. However, cooking it in the oven, um, using your oven tray, it's just as good. Um, for me, it's raining outside, so I can't um, cook my meat on the grill. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and cook it in the oven. The meat has been marinated for two hours. Let's go ahead and transfer it to the tray. I'll just slightly spray my baking paper and I'm just gonna spread my meat around the baking tray. Okay, so our meat is ready to go in the oven. I will preheat my oven at 180 degrees Celsius. I'm gonna start with 25 minutes uh, and then I'll turn the meat um, around and once it's cooked then I'll bring it out and we continue on with the rest of the recipe. Okay, let's put it in the oven. While the lamb is cooking, let me explain. Um, I made these pizza bread, they call them. I made them in one of my recipes earlier. So I can include the link in this video um, or I can put the recipe as well in the description um, along with our main recipe today. It's even nice to dip it in the garlic sauce and the hummus and then just enjoy it like that. But I'm excited to enjoy it with the, the meat. Okay everyone, I'll be right back 
when our meat is ready. Okay, families and friends, our lamb is cooked. Um, it's nice and tender and it has a little bit of crisp on it. So um, I'm gonna cool it down for a few minutes and then we will con we'll continue on uh, preparing our, our butterboard style for the lamb suvalaki. Okay, I've got this nice big board here. Uh, for those who have seen the butterboard trend on TikTok, um, you can use any board. Um, I really like that trend. I, I've tried the butterboard um, and I really enjoy it. And whoever came up with that idea, hats off to you for um, coming up with a fantastic idea. Uh, with all sorts of butterboard style. So in this video, I am making lamb suvalaki um, butterboard style. Now this is the best part, and this is my favorite part, is putting it together. So we will start by adding our hummus. You just spread it along the board. I'm going to go with my onions and sprinkle the onions on top of the hummus. I'm going to arrange my suvalaki bread just around it. And make sure you have enough hummus. More onions. We will go ahead and add our meat. Go with the parsley and sprinkle on top. Go ahead with the tomatoes. I really love this idea, really love the idea, even with a dessert, um, such a great idea. We can add some lettuce, add a little bit for now, but before I add more lettuce, I think we need to add our garlic sauce. All right. I'm going to go with my garlic sauce and just squirt on top, just like that. And then add more dollops of the hummus. lettuce more meat if you like and that is it that's our lamb suvalaki butter bread style pretty neat idea isn't it really really good idea you can go ahead and sprinkle more parsley when if you need to so all this normally goes into the suvalaki wrap but um, we are serving it in a butterboard style let's taste our food family so mm. so good I hope you give this recipe a try, families and friends. It is so good. Lamb, the peach root hummus flavor, the garlic sauce, 
and all the the flavoring the marinating um, ingredients for the lamb it just um, gives it a nice taste for our dish um, take my word for it I hope you give it a try it is really nice thank you for tuning in please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you again for your love and support I will see you in the next episode take care and God bless see ya bye